this might be MCU's first good guy, bad guy crossover. Hey, we're gonna talk about the Modoc. Three, two, one. Hey, everybody, it's Izzy from In the Name of Comics, and today we're gonna talk about. I don't even know what I'm talking about. This this character is just like the weirdest looking character. Get him. The weirdest character I ever covered. Get him. It's just just weird, guys. His name is Modoc. And do you know what Modoc stands for? Mental organism designed only for killing. Ah! For killing. For killing. Killing, y'all. Killing. This little dwarf guy. Get him. This fishbowl head guy. Get him. This aquarium face guy. Get him. I will rid the earth of superpowers. Even if it has to end with me. Is a killing machine. George Carlington. He's a former disgruntled employee of AIM, whatever you want to call it. He has beef with AIM, the Advanced Ideal Mechanics Company. And Tarlington, this guy, this guy is married to a supermodel. Yes, a supermodel named Alana Ivanova. You know, these Russian, these, these Russian names, they just, they just be killing me. Well, anyway, his jealous superior Red Ghost turned him into Modoc and and just messed up his life. He was seeking a cure, and he wound up becoming a subservient to the notorious Mandarin, y'all. It didn't even work out, but he tried. Give him an A for effort. Also, this being, let's just call him a being, because it's comfortable to say he's a being. He founded the notorious cabal that's like the nwo of of supervillains in comics and in, in, in the marvel world so these guys he teamed up with but of course he's a mess up and he betrayed red skull and i guess that was the end of the cabal this modok guy has a smaller version of itself a smaller version called elf it stands for, because I like to give you guys acronyms, it stands for Eternal Life Form. Mm. So there's a Poquito version, Poquito version of Modoc. And I don't know if he's more evil than him, but all these evil guys is just evil. evil. Little people are evil. So I know little people are evil. So we could just imagine what this elf character Modoc is. Um, what's amazing about this Modoc being is that he has the world's largest brain, y'all. So this guy, if he ain't in the Guinness Book of World Records, he should be in the Guinness Book of World Records for the world's largest brain. But it does have some downsides to it. It does have some downsides to it. Being that he has the largest brain, his organs are weak. He has an ectoskeleton. But a con is that he has this, this chair. It's called the doomsday chair, y'all. So he sits in his doomsday chair and it helps him with his big brain because he's big brained it. Modoc. Also, Modoc is superhuman. Superhuman. He has high intelligence because he's big brained it. And he's also a telepath. So, Modoc, he's one to look out for. There's a rumor that Modoc will be played by Ant Man's villain. Y'all know him as Yellow Jacket, but it's a rumor. Y'all heard it. It's also a rumor that Peyton Oswalt will be the voice of Modoc. So, uh, look out for that. Modoc's enemies are good and evil and a mix of sometimes both. Because at one time he battled Namor and Dr. Doom. But his enemies are Kang, 
Krylon, who will be played by the infamous Bill Murray in Ant-Man 3. Um, his company, because I told you guys that he's in the disgruntled employee of the company AIM, Scott Lang, and he has a problem with the family, and the Jolly Green Hawk. Another key tidbit is that we've seen Namor and Wakanda forever. So mm. he's connected. Modoc is connected. So look out for Modoc. Um, we will see, and y'all can quote me on this, we will see MCU's first good guy, bad guy crossover. And I say that to say this because at the end of Ant-Man one if you guys remember Yellow Jacket shrunk to what appears to be subatomic that's smaller than Poquito subatomic level and he was battling Scott Lang so maybe Yellow Jacket now becomes you guessed it the Modoc. Yeah. I even say kudos to the person who, who goes out there and tries to cosplay Modoc for Comic Con. Like, good luck to you, because beside being a hot, airy costume, God bless you. Just God bless you. So, there you have it. That's just my little intro to the man, the myth, the being, the fishbowl head the bad guy that takes on good guys and bad guys, the bad guy you love to hate, whatever twist you want to put on MODOK, there you have it. Your intro to MODOK, so at least you know about the guy. i see you guys in the theaters. I'm Izzy. This has been In the Name of Comics, Love, Peace, and Villain Grease. We out. Please like and subscribe to this In the Name of Comics YouTube channel. Join us on Facebook. Instagram, TikTok, and Twitter as well. Peace.